Wow, Clarissa Shields says F the boxing networks. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Renee Box Young. Thank you so much for liking, subscribing, sharing, showing your support, showing your love and appreciation, commenting in the comment sections, tuning into lives. I thank you so much, subscribers since day one, you know, uh, recent subscribers. Welcome to Renee Box Young. This is a platform where we discuss, analyze, critique the sport of boxing. As simple as that, man. I want to get right to this Clarissa Shields, man, the GWOAT. <laughs> you know, she went live recently on uh, Instagram. And I was tuning in there, man. It's great always to hear her, you know, something that uh, important things were talked about. She was uh, live. She went live with her promoter, all right? She went live with the promoter to clarify something in particular. She had something in her mind, you know what I'm saying? She definitely had something on her mind and she wanted to get it out there so that the boxing community can can listen and, uh, you know, hear what she had to say definitely about boxing networks. Um, it's a trip, man. She even named them, you know, ESPN, PBC, uh, DAZN, um, what, what's the other one out there? You know, just generally speaking, man, I don't remember. You can go check it out, man. Go to her Instagram uh, official profile. You'll see it, man. Um, you know, she pretty much labeled all the major, um, you know, named the major boxing networks. And it's interesting how she talked about that, you know, with her promoter that it's not as far, at least with her promoter, it's not, you know, her promoter that's keeping her from major fights uh, from happening. Uh, something along the lines of that. And she was speaking out for, you know, women's boxing in general, you know. Women's boxing is amazing. I mean, it, it, action-packed fights, just a few names. You already know Terry Harper, right? Uh, Katie Taylor, Taylor uh, you know, Amanda Serrano. I mean, the list goes on and on. I mean, you got some beautiful Jessica McCaskill, an amazing win recently. A few months ago, as a matter of fact. Um, you know, the list goes on and on, definitely. You know, amazing woman fighters, you know. Um, and... Uh, even even in bare knuckle fighting championship MMA, you know, what I'm saying I do keep my eye out, you know, definitely on BKFC. Also, as you know, um, I've been uh, I have posted some content concerning BKFC. I definitely appreciate you know women in combat sports, man. And um, it's interesting how she even uh, you know she even recognized Dana White as doing a great job in women, uh, you know, with with women in in, in MMA, and I have too. Uh, as far as, you know, generally speaking, I have said it time and time again, man, concerning, uh, you know, Dana White, he's doing what he's doing, you know, putting great fights out there, you know, and Clarissa Seals, uh, she wanted to get her point across that it's not her promoter, you know, that is limiting or, you know, limiting her from getting fights. She talked about, uh, you know, uh, a recent fight she had, you know, um, you know, on Showtime or one of her fights she had on Showtime, it was up to 450,000 viewers. I mean, great numbers, you know what I'm saying? Or, or, or pay-per-view buyers. I don't really remember, honestly, but, um, you know, go check out that, go check out the, the, the live session she had. It was short. I think it was like 20 some odd minutes. And she talked about that, man, that it, she said that, you know, F the boxing networks. I think she said that something along the lines that she thinks that women should, you know, get together, the women fighters, combat sports, you know, fighters, uh, you know, boxing, boxers, and to, you know, make some kind of network of their own, you know. And I think it's a shame that, you know, how networks limit, you know, uh, fighters and great woman boxing events you know um according to clarissa shields and i think she's definitely she's telling the truth she knows what's going on you know and um yeah it wouldn't wouldn't it be awesome to see like you know in great undercards or you know main events uh you know women fight fighting you know woman boxing you know championship bouts um you know it seems like uh, to a certain extent eddie hearn has done that quite a bit eddie hearn has been pushing it a lot I don't really know about the zone, but I think in match room he has. Um, so several fights. As a matter of fact, I made a post fight reaction on one of the the the, the girls who fought, one of the women who fought. Uh, it was months ago. Uh, it's not it's on my channel somewhere, so yeah, can check it out. I mean, it was an action packed, beautiful fight. I think it was uh, I forgot their names with the British woman and uh, somebody else, but um, it was a great fight, man. And um, so she did call out the networks, or she did uh, you know mention the networks how they're not you know they're 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 the ones who reject. You know, potential great fights uh, on their networks. You know, ESPN, PBC, The Zone. I think she mentioned another one. I just don't remember. Go ahead and check out her her her, her Instagram live. I'll leave the link in the description of her pro profile. I'm sure you guys are following her. You know, uh, those who are listening and tuning in, or maybe you're not. Right? Go ahead and check her out. I mean, 
you know, I really like Clarissa. She kept it really professional. She didn't even, you know, she did say it like that. F the Boxing Network. So <laughs> it definitely shouts out to her for keeping it clean. You know what I mean? Um, and I just want to make a quick video talking about that, you know, and just throwing that out there. You know, definitely I think that, you know, women definitely deserve more limelight and better pay. Um, you know, her, her promoter there uh, in the live session or what have you, right, said that, you know, they're not up to what they want. You know, as far as like pay and things of that nature. But, uh, you know, Clarissa Shields has opened up doors, you know, and um, several other fighters also have been, you know, following that that road, you know, that Clarissa Shields has opened for, you know, great events in the sport of boxing for women, you know, and I do definitely think you know, that women deserve a lot more pay, man. Women fighters, and generally speaking, in combat sports, they do deserve a lot more pay, you know, and um, I think it's kind of sad, you know, to see that. Because the thing here is that, I reiterate, women boxers, man, they bring so much action in fights. You know, Clarissa Shields, man, I've talked to her several times on my platform, I talked about her, you know, and, um, you know, I constantly reference my live session I had some time ago, some months ago. It was a long time ago. It was a while ago. Um, and we're in that session, I was talking about prospects, and I was specifically talking about Clarissa Shields giving my post-fight reaction on uh, when she beat Hammer. I knew she was going to beat Hammer. Um, you know, she's just a really skilled fighter. Clarissa Shields is very skilled, and I really like her. I really do, you know, um, which is why I follow her. And there are several other fighters I like out there. You know, Amanda Serrano. I mean, there are several other women fighters I really like out there. So, you know, they can, they can box. You know, they got great skills, and I think they they bring a, a, a wonderful, you know, entertainment, bring wonderful entertainment, you know, when it comes to sport of boxing. And I don't know why, you know, with the numbers that Clarissa Shields has pulled in, you know, in, in, in events and Showtime, uh, you know, I don't know why these boxing networks don't open the doors up more. And I'm speaking as a fan, you know, the sport of boxing. Why don't they open up doors more for, for women in the sport of boxing? I mean, they can definitely, you know, pull in some more numbers, you know what I mean? They definitely can. And Clarissa Shields was talking about that. And I think that personally, Clarissa Shields is going to make some big moves, you know, when it comes to the sport of boxing. You know, I think she's going to really open up doors more, more, even more, you know, for, for women boxers, you know what I mean? And to put women out there in the limelight more and that they, you know, make more money also and get, you know, better opportunities that they definitely deserve. So I just want to make this video short, man, and definitely talk about this, you know, and, uh, and go ahead and follow, check her out on IG, you know, Instagram, and go ahead and check out that live session that she, you know, what she was talking about there. Uh, thank you so much. Comment in the comment section. What do you think? You know, I'm definitely, I've been, I've been following Clarissa for a while, man. I really love seeing her box. So, um, hopefully there's going to be an announcement soon. Uh, you know, the promoter, her promoter said that soon there will be an announcement of her fighting. You know, I'm not really sure about that whole MMA thing, if she's going to go fight in MMA or what have you, but I think she is going to have a boxing, you know, a fight in boxing soon. So we hope so. I definitely hope so. So comment in the comment section. What do you think? You know, definitely go ahead and opinionate, man. Renee Box Young, thank you so much. Stay safe out there. Peace out, fam.